Tonight's musical guests have topped just about every bluegrass Americana or gospel chart there is. They have received multiple industry honors, including four consecutive Female Vocalist of the Year awards from the International Bluegrass Music Association. Their latest album is absolutely wonderful. It's called This Life We're Living. Would you please welcome Darren and Brooke Aldridge. You know, I, I told the audience before the show tonight that your, your career is on fire. I mean, you're everywhere, and it just seems like so many doors are opening up because people are relating to the music that you're writing and that you're performing. So this, this life we're living, that's really what it's about? That's, really is. That's right. We're blessed. We, we wanted to give people a little bit more insight uh, to Darren and Brooke on this album, and um, I feel like we, we did that. And, uh, you know, just to be a couple, a married couple, and, uh, you know, our roots started in church with our family singing and, uh, you know, just always instill God in our lives. And uh, I think that's the reason that doors have opened for us. So. Well, you're blessing us, and you've become a blessing, and you're being blessed. And I think that's exciting. And one of the songs on this album, you're going to do it for us a little later, is a song called Grand Old Circle. Mm -hmm. I want you to tell us about the song, because it'll help us better understand it when we're performing it. Well, a good friend of ours uh, that's in the audience here, Mr. Bill White, he asked us an idea of, uh, man, y'all play the Opry so much, and you're a young couple, and, you know, in bluegrass and country and gospel, and I know folks would like to hear your story. And that circle is at the uh, Grand Ole Opry now, but it came out of the old Ryman Auditorium, right. didn't it? It did mm -hmm. in 1974, and uh, we wanted to add that history, you know, not make it so much about us, uh, per se, but you know, just give the Opry a shout out and uh, thank them for always being a beacon of hope in, in hard times. And they've, they've proved to do that all these uh, years. Our show's connection to the Opry happens to be that Keith Bilbrey, our announcer, was the Opry's announcer for 35 years. That's and, right. And so we feel a connection there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's, it's just, there's a historic nature to the Grand Ole Opry that's unlike any other performance venue in the entire world. Mm -hmm. Nothing quite like it. And so many of the names in the song are people that influenced you. Yes, very much so. And it, it was hard, you know, in four minutes to add everybody that we wanted to include. <laughs> um, but we tried to get as many as we could think of uh, in that amount of time. And of course, that had to rhyme, so. <laughs> yeah, of course, it had to rhyme. That's part of the deal of the song. But right. well, we're going to let everyone see what an amazing song it is, The Grand Old Circle. While we get ready to perform, Keith Bilber, who knows a thing or two about The Grand Old Circle, he's going to tell you how you can hear more of the great music of Darren and Brooke Aldridge. For tour dates, recordings, and more, and to see a digital exclusive performance of the song Old Fashioned, go to Huckabee.tv.